it was a cold day, wind was blowing, 7.30 in the morning no one was here, and then all of a sudden a couple people came, and before 8 o'clock we had a long line. Yeah, Maple Sunday is the big, is the big day for us, yeah, everybody's, everybody's involved. Well, somebody would be directing traffic, somebody would be up in the barn, uh, doing barn tours, somebody would be down the sugar house. I will be hopefully talking to people, and it takes quite a staff here to put out the meal. There's probably 15 people here. People come from everywhere, cars parked up and down the road, walking for half a mile to get here, and it, uh, it was a good big day. We've been married 56 years. Togetherness, you know. <laughs> we started farming in 1966. We've been doing maple since 19, I think 1986. Well, what Ed and I thought originally, wanted to have a place where we could uh, harvest everything here at the farm, make a living here on the farm, and have a place where people could come and bring their families. I call, I say, well, you call me, and I called you, and then a couple times, yeah. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. I think people glamorize what we do, and, and it is fun, and I do love it, but it's a lot of hard work. You, you have to have it in your blood or you wouldn't, you wouldn't, uh, you, you wouldn't last. Over the years, he knows what he needs to do, I know what I need to do, and it, it, it works. He has, he has his, his areas, he takes care of all this wood on this farm, I don't know how he does it. It keeps all these fires going and keeps, it, uh, keeps everything going. Pat is uh, really the kind of the brains of the outfit. She takes and uh, does all the figuring and handles all the money. But talking to people, customers, keeping the customers happy and waiting on customers day after day. We have two sons, we have two daughters. The oldest one uh, has helped us from, from the very beginning. She likes to, she's good in the kitchen. She, she's really, and big crowds don't bother her. The next one is Scott. He's lived away, now he's moved back and he runs the greenhouses. The next one is um, David. He's mechanically, very mechanical, and he can put anything together and tear it down and put it back together again. And our youngest daughter is a, a professional singer, so she's not home very much. And when she's home, it's, it's, it's a real treat to have her here. So she doesn't get involved in the, in the farm very much. No, they all had their own ideas, they all had their own careers, but they also come back and help us too. My favorite part of the whole business is people. I, I, I'm fascinated with, pe with people's stories. Meeting people, that is the best part. I never get tired of it. I get tired of the hardware, but I don't get tired of meeting people. <laughs>